Hey, integrating GitHub with Test Launch is quick, easy, and painless, allowing issues to be automatically created whenever a test fails. So let's get to it. Firstly, we need to grant Test Launch access to your GitHub account. We can do this by selecting Issue Trackers from the side menu and choosing to create a new integration. Select GitHub from the dropdown and click the Authenticate link where you'll be sent over to GitHub to provide access. From here, we need to associate a test launch project with a GitHub repository. This is where your issues will be created. To do this, edit a test launch project and select the GitHub integration that you just set up. Choose the correct repo ID from the list and save the changes. Now, if we go to create a new test run from an existing suite, whenever a test fails, test launch will automatically create an issue in GitHub, taking away the tedious task of manually creating them. Additionally, we can also set other GitHub options such as the assigned user, issue label, and milestone directly from test launch. If you'd rather update an existing issue, just associate it with the test and test launch will add a comment to this existing ticket instead of creating a new one. Let's quickly jump over to GitHub, where issues for the failed test have been created, all of which contain the relevant and important information for a developer to replicate and fix the problem. Once all issues are resolved, we can go back to test launch and choose to rerun all the failed tests to verify any fixes. There are some other pretty cool features too. You'll have the ability to request test launch to pull back the GitHub issue state of all failed tests within a test run. Not only that, but you can rerun tests based on the result in test launch as well as the issue state in GitHub. This means we could create a rerun with all tests that failed which have closed issues in GitHub. When executing the rerun, if a GitHub issue has already been created for the test, test launch will update this instead of creating a new one. You can even change the GitHub issue state and assign the ticket to a different person directly from test launch. And that's it. Pretty simple, right? For more information and a free 30-day trial, head over to testlaunch.com.